And welcome to the Tongue of the Trees channel. I'm Elizabeth Ashley, the secret healer, and I understand you want to know what RC essential oil is for, or what is Roman chamomile essential oil for? Well, you've come to the right place. I am a clinical aromatherapist with tw over 25 years professional experience. I am the UK director of the National Association of Holistic Aromatherapists. I am an author of aromatherapy manuals of which there are over 20 secret healer manuals. And most importantly for this video, I am the co-creator of the Tongue in the Trees cards. So, Roman chamomile. One of my favorite essential oils, I have to say, I am a big chamomile queen. I love all chamomiles. Um, I work with three chamomiles, but we're only going to talk about the one today. Just to, to clarify, you might see German or blue chamomile or chamomile matricaria. They're all the same oil. Um, they're blue. And then the essential oil is blue. That's why um, it's called that, in incidentally. It comes from, if you look at the picture, actually, it's not quite the same plant, but it looks very similar. It's a white daisy kind of plant with a yellow middle, as is the matricaria uh, daisy. But the um, essential oil is blue and that happens when it goes through distillation. So that's a piece of magic in its own right. But there is another, it's going to be a separate video on chamomile matricaria. I also use chamomile maroc or Moroccan chamomile which is Ormanis multicolis, so it isn't a chamomile at all, even though we call it chamomile. Um, not to be um, confused with tansy or blue tansy oil, different again. But so this video is about Roman chamomile and um, it's a fantastic oil. It's fantastic in so many different ways. You could, I could talk about it for ages. So what we're going to do in this video is completely talk only about the um, physical properties of the essential oil. And afterwards, when we get to the end of that, if you think, well, I really like the sound of that. I've got a bottle of uh, chamomile essential oil and I'd like to know all the different ways of using it. Then I'm going to give you a link to another video that will uh, tell you about how to um, use it for emotional, uh, mental health support, physical, uh, sorry, spiritual. And by that, I don't mean um, religious. I mean that kind of journey back to yourself of overcoming obstacles, whether that would be um, familial, cultural or societal. It's a continuous battle, isn't it, of kind of trying to be the most you that you can be and to keep yourself happy. And I don't think anything's as good for that as essential oils, that that relationship that the brain has with the, the smell, because that's proper aromatherapy. So we'll talk about that in the other video, but for now, let's just talk about the physical medicine. And what do I mean by that? I mean, what happens to your body when you um, use Roman chamomile essential oil? We're not going to talk really about the mind. We're not going to talk about the emotions or the, the spiritual, just the physical. Um, it's the most powerful anti-inflammatory oil um, that I know, really. Um, if you have inflammation, is a is a massive, massive subject, isn't it? You know, um, the body is continually dealing with inflammation, and. It's only really a problem when it goes out of control. So things like arthritis, where there's inflammation in the joints, or um, you hurt yourself and it becomes inflamed. So straight away, that's two different types of in inflammation, isn't it? That we've got the swelling, but we've also got inflamed skin is red. So I also think we talk about inflamed temper. Yeah, 
any kind of inflammation, Roman chamomile is beautiful. And in the other video, we'll talk about safety more. But what I can tell you about Roman chamomile is it's so gentle, so safe. It would be one of the oils that I would go for people who are in a weakened state. So if somebody has long-term pain, inflammation, Roman chamomile. Um, children who are upset, Roman chamomile. It's such a beautiful, gentle, gentle oil. And um, I, uh, I have nothing to do with how beautiful these cards are, but um, the artwork, has been coordinated by a Hungarian aromatherapist called Gegle Halodi, who is my co-creator. And he's going to tell me off about this video because I'm going to talk a little bit about the emotional side. And he's going to go, well, that's supposed to be in the other video, but I can't resist. So um, there's just something about chamomile um, that goes... Que sera, sera, whatever will be, will be. It's kind of just, oh, let's just go with the flow. Go with the flow. And so, always reminds me of like lying back on the grass and watching the clouds in the sunshine. That's, that's absolutely the energy of um, chamomile. So, that's quite childish, childlike, isn't it? Um... So it's great for that nurturing. It's really nurturing and trustworthy, you know, and that's why it would be great for weakened people and children. Yeah. Um. So I've put down here redness and sorus. We've talked about that. But if you have got like, it's very good for allergies. So allergic eczema, for example, or contact dermatitis, where you've used different sham. Uh, um, Washing powder, I was going to say shampoo, but you could say shampoo, but washing powder. Um, my little boy, whom you will meet at the end of the video, continuously has a red spot here. And we only have to need to put his chamomile cream on once and it's out of here. You know, it's it, it deals with it straight away. Um, hay fever. You know, um, I would use some Melissa with it because that's a natural antihistamine. It's anti-allergenic, but it's very good for calming down the oh, itchy, itchy, itchy eyes. And it's in my nose and, you know, the, ooh, you feel like you're getting gnats all over you, don't you? All of that calmed by Roman chamomile. Very, very calming that way. Um, tonic effect for the liver. I'm repeating myself now because I've said this in several videos um, very cleansing to the liver after stress. Um, but if you have things like eczema, again, where you have the atopic um, flare-up because of allergic um, reaction, it's more in-depth medicine to know that the liver underpins that, but it does. Um, and so, um, and chamomile for that. Digestive. Now, between you and I, I look all right today, considering that a week ago I was in hospital with a lot of digestive problems. And um, I have been using my oils, but the chamomile tea has been the absolute uh, godsend. Um, I've had very bad acid reflux and it's burned all my esophagus. And the chamomile tea was calming to the inflammation, but it soothed the digestive as well and beautiful uh, i'm very very thankful to my case Sarah, Sarah girl for this i have to say i feel so much better quickly thank you to it if um somebody is suffering from diarrhea excellent and because it's um good for children fantastic for that too It'll calm the diarrhea, but just as important as it, it calms that griping and that pain that you get with the diarrhea as well. Another me, you see, um, in in the peppermint um video, I talk about how you have your healing click and why you know certain oils become your friend. Chamomile is so my friend. 
because there's so many things that I have to use it for, I have really bad restless legs. And so I use uh, Roman chamomile and clary sage to help with my restless legs. Fantastic because it calms, it soothes, and because it's um, an antispasmodic. Any kind of cramping, any kind of spasm in any way, then uh, Roman chamomile will help. So we kind of touched on <clears throat> the um, emotional and um, mental aspects of the oil. You can go much more deeply. It's a really healing oil emotionally. Um, and so we'll do that in the other video. And likewise, we'll look at the safety side. Now, for, for many of the oils, I would say the safety side is that important. But you don't really have to worry very much about the safety with chamomile. Although we do cover it. We cover it about how you can use it in, um, when it's safe to use in pregnancy. Is it safe in breastfeeding with the children? Is Roman chamomile safe for cats and dogs? Now, I never had to learn that when I was training, but this has become a big area of concern. So I've had to learn all of that. So I can give you that detail. Um, more importantly, though, I talked about Gergley earlier. Gergley has a better eye than I have. He's very good at visual stuff. But he also has a much better nose than I have. He's extremely good at blending and doing sort of aromatic perfumery and stuff. So when I did the listings of writing the notes for these videos, I went through and I did the safety and I did the emotional and the mental and the physical and the spiritual, etc, etc. And all the ways that I would use the essential oil for the other video. And then I left a gap where it said blending. Roman chamomile is, blends well with, and I left a space for Gergely to write it. So you and I are going to nick the uh, notes of one of the best blenders in the world. <laughs> so I do hope that you can watch this other video. Um, apart from it being a masterclass in Roman chamomile oil, and I will get excited because I love chamomile. Um, and there's sort of four other reasons to do so. First of all, I'll tell you how you can download this book for free. Um, as you can see, it's quite the tome. And um, really, you know, it's kind of what I did for my aromatherapy diploma that took me a year to complete all in one book. And I give that away for free. So I'll tell you how to get that on my other video. We'll also obviously talk lots more about the emotional, mental and spiritual aspects. And so therefore we get more involved in the cards. And uh, I'll tell you how, if you want to, how you can use these cards, but also how you can get some. <clears throat> um, and also I'll tell you about the distributor that we've chosen to get those out to you. They are an essential oil supplier. And so if you felt, well, I do want the cards, um, but I also would really like some Roman, mark, Roman chamomile essential. I feel like I need them and I haven't got it. Great they can send it out to you and save you some shipping because you'll always be, already be buying the cards. So there's that. But also, um, I will tell you how to access a further video if you want to, where we talk about recipes. So if, for example, you say, well, I've got somebody who has got irritable bowel syndrome and you've told me how to use it, but I'm not still not very confident doing that. Well, that's fine. This video tells you, right, I'm going to tell you this many drops and I'm going to use this carrier and I'm going to heat it and I'm going to stir it. Watch me do it and we'll do it through it together. So you can get that video too. So it's valuable. This first video, this first video is free that you're watching now. The next video is free too. So please do come across and watch it. If you look in the description below, you can see there is a link at the top of the description that will take you straight through to my website where you can get your hands on that for free. Now, if you are a um, person selling doTERRA Roman chamomile essential oil or Young Living Roman chamomile essential oil, then you... Your business is going to rely on you being able to sell that effectively to as many people as you can. So these masterclasses are fantastic for you. There are 56 cards in here. So therefore, 56 videos must be made to talk about all of them. So I am going to 
pass you across in a minute because I'm the right person to talk about aromatherapy but if you want to know how to use YouTube properly you ask a 10 year old <laughs> so Dexter my son is going to tell you how you can like and share and subscribe to the channel which all of which thank you if you do they help our business enormously but also if you are somebody who thinks well I really want to get my hands on this free teaching I don't want to miss any then he's going to show you a magic way to get notifications every time Gagle or I upload any more content so without further ado I'm going to pass you across to the maestro and say don't forget to click the link come to the masterclass and uh, we will talk about what is roman chamomile essential oil good for so you get your phone you turn it this way up and then there's a little red subscribe button turn it gray by clicking it and then there's a little bell click that and press all at the bottom of your phone or tablet or computer it will say you will receive all notifications and then there's a little hand with a thumbs up click that it will turn it blue and it says added to your liked videos and there will be comments and if you want to you can send a comment or, and say like hi to mum and gagle and then the link to the next video will be in the description below underneath the video. So, bye!